Oh, guys, it is not getting better. It is, in fact, getting a little bit worse. I think that they think something else is giving them points, and they're not understanding that zero is zero. <laughs> We're still getting zero. Without looking it up, next topic here, without looking it up, explain to me why we call someone we like our crush. I know the answer to this, but would you like an opportunity to go first, Mark? No, I'm thinking. Okay. I'm thinking deeply about this one. Mm -hmm. May okay. I approach the bench? I guess, yeah, why not? How many points have I, do I have? <laughs> oh, I guess I can give us a tally of total points here. All right. Uh, in the first round, Bob got five points. Uh -huh. And in the second round, he got seven. But then he's gotten two goose eggs. So Bob's sitting at 12 points. That's two goose eggs. Mark, you got one point in the first round, one point in the second round. But in the third round, you started catching back up with two. So you're down 12 to four. What's a goose egg? Zero. Ah, okay. Nada. Zilch. All right. May I walk away from the bench? By all means, please. Will put in the sounds of me walking away from the bench. A little dramatic, but okay, there you are. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I stand before you a humble man. A humble man with the same hopes and dreams as all of you. The accused stands to gain nothing from this. They walk into this willingly. They are human and to err is human. Am I right? Am I right? I am what, right. What's happening? <laughs> I would like to propose for you all to consider simply to consider that as we are all human we all make mistakes and a mistake should not cost a man his life or a woman their own for are we not all equal in the eyes of the law and i only ask you to consider my case with fairness and justice in mind thank you thank you your honor i yield my time ladies and gentlemen of the jury Opposing counsel stood before you and called himself a humble man. Does a humble man own five ovens? Objection, your honor. I no longer own five ovens. Withdrawn. Would a humble man <laughs> speak so highly of himself, brag so openly about being so humble? Would a humble man ask you to view the vicious criminal he has sitting next to him as just one of us? As a human with rights? I suggest that he would not. I suggest that opposing counsel is full of it. And he's rubber and I'm glue. Wait, reverse that. Your Honor, scratch that from the record. Yeah, scratch. Look, listen, we're all here today talking about a civil case of a crush gone wrong. Everybody knows when you have a crush, of course, crush, meaning uh, a, a general interest in dating or a liking of another person, uh, derived, of course, from the behavior that all children exhibit, where when they get too excited and like something, they crush it out of excitement and lack of self-control. It's a crush gone wrong. It's an infatuation gone awry. And uh, the defendant is guilty. I think we've shown that. I think the evidence bears witness to that. I think you can tell from the tone of my voice, I wouldn't lead you wrong. You could trust me. Objection, Your Honor. This is hearsay or something like that. He's injecting uh, his own opinion into things. I I need to approach another bench. So I'm going to talk to our dear listeners for a moment here and uh, call, just Honor. give me a moment. This court is I a don't sham. know what's happened. This might be a sham. They've lost it. We, we, were, we were doing something and that, yeah, they've sure. lost it. I, I, I don't know how to give points anymore. I think he's afraid We've gone we're so off the him. rails. No I've lost sight of the train. All right, don't worry. I'm back. I'm back. All right, okay. we talked this out. And uh, okay, so you guys, that was very creative. I liked your little courtroom scene here. Uh -huh. um, I feel like the question wasn't answered all that well, but you know, that doesn't really matter too much. I feel like I answered it completely. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give each of you zero points. I feel like I answered the question you asked completely. I feel like I uh, I didn't. Perfect. But I was part of the legal process and therefore equal partners in it. Let's um, uh, Let's move on quickly and painfully to the next topic. 